What's up guys, welcome back to something completely new. Uh, this is actually funny, I just woke up and I've received plenty private messages prompting me to, uh, to check out this brand new game called New World. And so I did, I was curious myself, um, I, I looked it up on Steam, apparently it's 40 euros for me. Um, at first I didn't consider actually getting it, but then it said it's similar to Trove and similar to other uh, games I've uh, played before, so... Uh, I have to give it a try, especially considering since it's brand new apparently, it's had a, um, an alpha or a beta testing phase before, but it was just launched. So this is as fresh as it can get. Right, so that said, I'm not entirely sure this is, uh, this is gonna be a first look uh, at everything, I don't know what to expect, I'm not entirely sure what this game is about either, so... Um, I may actually be needed to create an account, I believe, global announcement. Okay, guess they had some issues with the, with the servers continue. Right, let's... I guess I'm... Um, I have to choose a world now. EU Central, this sounds fitting, seems to be the best um, region for me. I will go with the first one, I guess. Zero players in queue, okay. Hmm, interesting, so uh, you may have characters uh, depending on the world you choose, I'm not entirely sure. You know what, let's just go with Inferno, this is the first one. Venheim Ultra, okay, select world and it says play Inferno. You can only, you can only have one character in the uh, Venheim Ultra world set, okay. If you wanna play in another Venheim Ultra world, you'll need to delete this character, right? If you have friends playing in other uh, Venheim Ultra worlds, you will not be able to play with them. That's unfortunate. I I hope I'm doing the right thing. I um, nothing that I show what to pick. Look at that. A world set is a uh, collection of selected worlds. Worlds within a world set may be merged together if necessary to give players the best experience. Ah, you know what, I, I think I, I feel I'm uh, spending way too much time on picking a server. I understand, let's start playing in board camera. I will uh, take care of those uh, later, later I meant. Subtitles, that sounds useful. Yeah, we can continue. Um, adjust the brightness settings for your display until the new world logo is barely visible. Oh, actually 50 was uh, just fine. <laughs> I guess the other 50 is uh, just fine. Continue. stories you've heard they don't tell the whole truth the island is indeed the place of legend there's power and vast riches as well but those who've gone before you have simply vanished never heard from again i saw the horror the madness that overcame the crew it was beyond any evil the world has ever known. How I survived, I do not know. The contents of this box are not of this world. They will guide you to that one, wherever and whatever that may be. Go then, Captain. Charge your course and your fate. I will say a prayer for the souls of your crew. Wow, alright. I, uh, I kind of refrained from uh, speaking, uh, talking over the cutscene. That was... 
Oh, it's not over. Could this be me? And I think it is. Wow, what a chin. Uh, what a beautiful cutscene. Also, very, very cinematic. I um, I fully enjoyed the armor of the guy who entered the uh, tavern. Especially the face mask. That was pretty epic. It had beard elements in it. Uh, very beautiful. Right, so I guess we get to customize our character. Um, Let's start with the body type. So you, ch uh, you choose between male or um, female, okay, face options. Yeah, I think I'll uh, settle on this one. Skin tone, uh, let's go, huh, maybe this one. <laughs> I'm trying to uh, figure out what resembles uh, me the most. I guess that works. Um, Hairstyle, god, there's so many hair options. <laughs> you know what, I'll go over uh, every of, oh wow. Such a, such a beautiful hairstyle, look at that. I wish you could, um, wait, oh, was gonna say wish you could rotate the character, but there you go, you can actually do that. That's very convenient. Uh, I will go over these um, off camera not to bore you and uh, see which one is the most suitable for me. Wow, look at this one, beautiful. Vintage, <laughs> extremely vintage. Yeah, I, I think I spent way too much time going over these, but this one uh, looks rather beautiful. It actually kinda starts resembling Geralt, in a way. Anyway, um, oh wow, this one is also rather cute. <laughs> Hopefully you can uh, you can change it um, if you change your mind. Oh, beards! God damn, okay. This changes everything. I gotta mesh my hairstyle with my beard now. Oh my god, look at this beauty. <laughs> look at this beard right here. Um, I think I'm gonna settle on a purple car color for uh, both the hair and the facial hair. Wow. Magnificent. Um, uh, sure, let's go with that. Eye color is purple, of course. Or white. White also look beautiful. Look at that. I like the customization options so far. Features, what are these? Oh, wrinkles, right. Um, or rather, beauty marks. Uh, we'll go. This looks rather interesting. Nah, we'll go with nothing for uh, for now. Scars. Oh, we should have some scars. Maybe. Uh, can you can you like change scar location? I wonder. <laughs> this one looks like you'd you'd wear um, goggles uh, way too often. Anyway, let's go with. Trying to find a larger one. Wow, you can even place tattoos. Okay. Ah. Uh, Damn. Wow, look at this one. So beautiful. You know what? <laughs> you could you could make a separate video with only the customization options alone. Wow, they're so beautiful. They are all so beautiful. I think I'll actually go uh, with this one. Nothing that I show what the uh, droplet signifies, but it looks rather nice. I like how, how it covers my forehead and um, slightly touches my uh, my eyes, my character's eyes, of course. And I think we are done, so I should probably click on next. Name your character, Lord Fuffy, please. Hopefully it's available. <laughs> there you go, create character. You cannot change your uh, name or appearance. You cannot change your appearance after this point. Well, you could always wear masks, right? In case you're uh, totally in disagree with what you've selected. So create character. Yeah, sure. It's rather beautiful. I'll accept it as it is. Oh, look at that. It's even proud of itself. Or rather, himself. Oh, what's... All right, I think a shipwreck might have just happened. Waiting, to oh. <laughs> I'm prompted with the various messages. Waiting to log in, positioning Q1. Uh, oh, it's happening, it's loading. I like the loading animation too. 
What? Incoming downtime. I didn't even I didn't even have time to uh, time to play. Then the maintenance is is in twenty minutes. I don't have time for this. Uh, move. Oh. Hey, this is the guy, right? I remember. Oh God. Wow. This is a nice tutorial, actually. Uh, oh, dodge. Interesting. Heavy attack. <laughs> that was enough, apparently. Captain Aldous Thorpe. Um, talk. You, come closer. Your captain needs you. There's something wrong. I'm not feeling right. What happened? Even though I, uh, I, I think I have a clue. We both had a, uh, or rather, survived a shipwreck. Storm. What in the nine hells was that about? And where is my box? I need my box. Did you take it? You build rat. <laughs> I just gained consciousness. I uh, didn't take your box. Something isn't right. To come so close, it's not fair. What? What's happening to me? I can't die. Not like this. And we, we can accept a quest. Soul, soul survivor. Oh no! He actually died. What? And he vaporized. Apparently I can loot the guy. Okay, sake. I got a warm round shield and light ration. I guess that's food related, right? View the, the items in your inventory using tab. Okay. Warm round shield. 100 gear. Okay, you got gear scores. I gotta say the interface is rather beautiful. A bit on the grim side, but beautiful. Um, 100 gear score and this is a consumable, of course. Well, guys, since the maintenance uh, seems to be coming um, shortly, I guess there's no point in rushing around and exploring the world. I, j I, can, I can just uh, take my time and um, see what's, uh, what's up with this gear. Um, 70 damage apparently deals damage, 3% critical hit chance, 1.3 critical damage multiplier, 43 block stamina damage. And 30% blocking stability. This round shield has certainly seen better days. You should replace it as soon as you can. I like the description element. It also uh, also says tier 2. And uh, scales with strength. Okay. Has a weight uh, factor of uh, 3. And durability status as well. Okay. Uh, good to know. Can I, can I drag and drop it? Yes, I can. And apparently it got equipped. I can also equip the food. Apparently, let me just go over it uh, real quick. So, what kind of info can we uh, get from this? Uh, consumable recover 40 health per second for 20 seconds. This recovery stops if uh, damage is taken. Okay. Afterwards, recovery 1% of your health every 2.5 seconds for 20 minutes. Tier one, this one, 0.6 weight and the effect duration 20 minutes. I um. Is this like a hot bar of sorts? I don't want to consume it. So I guess this is equipped in my hot bar, I believe. Con oh, there you go. Consuming food and uh, drink restores health. And um, if I was to press 3 on my keyboard, I guess I would eat it. And you have an actual eating animation. How nice. It said well fed and recovering. This is beautiful. I like it. I definitely look like a hobo, but... My haircut is splendid, even though we had a um, shipwreck happening. Where's the ship actually? Is this it? No, it was larger. I had my own room or something. Can I can can I swim? Oh, it's a it's an invisible wall. No. No. Well, let's keep going. So, soul survivor, escape the ship graveyard to look for your crewmates. I was gonna say that's the freaking ship. <laughs> it's right in front of me. Anyway, since we have like 10 minutes left of uh, gameplay, I think I'm gonna end the episode right here. Jump! Oh, the um, <laughs> jumping is not too explosive. You don't seem to be able to jump that high. Oh well. 
still the still seems to do its job anyway guys this is definitely gonna be it for today i'll um, definitely reco uh, recover what i'll uh, come back after the um maintenance i'm not entirely sure how long it lasts it says i should visit a website for details which i will write uh, right after this so that said man i'm so excited it's such a shame for this maintenance thank you so much for watching i'll leave, I'll, uh, leave a link in the uh, description this is nice what is that drowned sailor Seems to be walking and alive to me, but oh well. <laughs> I was gonna say I'll leave a link to this game in the um, description uh, if you wanna check it out. And uh, more action will definitely come in future episodes, I'm pretty sure of it. But until then, thank you so, so much for watching. I will see you on the next one. Thank you very much for watching this video. Remember to like it if you enjoyed it, dislike it if you did not, and don't forget to leave a comment saying, well, anything that crosses your mind. This will help the channel greatly. I'll see you on the next one.